My name is Madison and I'm four years old. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, K, L, M, N, O, P. I like pizza and fish and croutons. Play at the park and at Chuck E. Cheese. I did go to school but I stopped. One day she just woke up and mom, my right leg is hurting me. And then after some time, the pain escalated and the fever kept rising and I knew something was wrong. They did t blood tests and saw some things and I got a call from Dr. Weiner when they saw those cancer cells. Not being in the medical field, I didn't really know exactly what leukemia was. And then when I heard it's cancer, I'm like, okay. I mean, I don't want to say I act like nothing was wrong, but I had to put on that strong face and just know that it's the worst that a parent could possibly hear, but uh, we're gonna have to get through it, no matter what. We were in the hospital for about eight weeks, where she got treatment almost every, every week. They put the needle, and they draw blood. They give me medicine. It's a lot. It's many different medications. You have to do um, lumbar punctures. It's like um, they do chemo in the spine. So it's a combination of the intravenous medicine and also the spinal medicine. It's been hard in the beginning. One day your life is normal and then another day it's like crazy because you would never imagine something like this to happen. Supporting the doctors and the hospital is a must. I mean, we cannot do it without that. If we didn't have the hospital and the doctors that we had, I mean, who knows what would have happened. They are almost the main reason why we're at where we're at today. You know, we're in remission, we're doing great, and we have to give all the thanks to them. Couldn't have did it without them. And you know, research is very important. A wonderful, wonderful team. Just speaking to Dr. Wiener on the phone just assured me that she was gonna be okay. And she's okay, she's in remission. Life is like a deck of cards. And we're all gonna get a hand, you know, and this was the hand that I was dealt. So you either fold or you play. And I'm gonna play. Even though it might be, at the time, the worst words that you can hear, you still have to find hope that it's gonna be okay. And trust that it's gonna be okay. A day without pediatric cancer would be a beautiful day. A day where you can put your heart at ease that everything is okay, that it's, it's gonna be alright.